Oh, iMovie. Oh, iMovie. I want you so much. What's up, guys? It's Michaela. Today, I this is my second video today. I know. But I'm super, super, super excited. Because I may get iMovie. Now, this is not a promise, like, at all. I need to first tell you guys the whole story. So, I, so, uh, when I had the camera, which I still do, it's going to get fixed really soon, but I would use Windows Live Movie Maker on our Windows computer, because that's what we've always had. We've never even, like, had a Mac computer, except, I don't know why I'm doing that, my mom has a really, really old Mac computer. It's so old, it's not even called Mac. It's called a Macintosh, and it, like, doesn't even have skills. This is a Mac computer that I made for my dolls. And it's like the modern type, like the back is really skinny. Like that. Like this is normal for modern Macs, but with my mom's, it goes like out, like all the way like that, and it's like really ugly, and it doesn't even have like this little stand thing. It's just like this with the giant back. But that back part is kind of good because it means it has tons of storage. Now since it's a Mac, a lot of the newer Macs come with iMovie, which is one of the biggest editing systems in the world. Besides Final Cut Pro X, but that is like $300, and I don't want to pay $300 for an editing system. I prefer free ones. And anyway, I have been checking for like as long as I've been making stop motions to see if it has iMovie, because the problem with Windows Live Movie Maker, okay, it's okay, but the thing is, since I use it, like, it's not as powerful. Like, if I want to make a stop motion about longer than a minute, it, like, will not work. So that's why a lot of my longer stop motions, it's just, like, a picture and then the voice recording, and I'm playing the picture for a long time, when they would have been going like this, like a Basil Mento stop motion, but I can't because then there would be even more pictures. And, yeah, it's the pictures amount. So you can make it as long as you want, like, even with just one picture, then it wouldn't be a stop motion. But on iMovie, whoa, that's different. And it would allow me to do so much more and be able to like finally do what I've always wanted. I have so many stop motions planned that I would do if I had iMovie. And I couldn't find it on my mom's computer. But today, there I am in the mirror. <laughs> okay, I got the Anyway, today uh, my mom called me and she said that she actually found it on there. Which is just awesome. But the thing is, since it's so old, it's like one of the oldest or perhaps the oldest Apple product. I think they even made it when Steve's job, Steve Jobs was still alive. I'm not even sure, though. But, um, if, so it might be too old for me to even use. But if I can use it, that would just be awesome. And I can make awesome stop motions. Because you guys do not know. Sometimes if I can't sleep in the middle of the night, I just think of, like, a stop motion idea. And I'll be like, oh, and there'd be this and this and this. But then I can never do that. So if I get to do this this is just but you guys also know that one of the key parts of stop motion is a camera which i still have but you know it doesn't really work so once we get it fixed if i can still do that that would be awesome or i could like take the pictures with like my phone because my phone takes so much better pictures than the ipad um and then import them from there or yeah but iMovie is just a great editing system i know i have it on my mom's ipad but it does not allow you to make stop motions like that's the thing about it that i hate because like i tried i have done it before with this app but then i have to like move it from the app into iMovie and it takes forever but there's no way you can just take the pictures and do that because of the automatic ken burns effect on the ipads but on the computers you can take that effect away and like crop your pictures so they're so they're like full screen or Anything you want. And there is my annoying cat. Go away. Go away. Sorry. I just wanted to make this little video to tell you guys. And I look so weird in that mirror. Oh my god. You know, ha, it's closed. But anyway, if I do get to use iMovie, this will just be absolutely awesome. I will have like Basil Mento's quality stop motions once I get the camera fixed. But I would because like some people they don't like to make stop motions but some people they just like basil mentos is the stop motion queen of youtube and now that she's gone i think a lot of people are going to be really upset now i'd like to recognize this emmy of white fox stop motion is doing awesome she just made a stop motion i think it's called like 
Blair Meets the Family or something. But it's really awesome. It's like six minutes long. Emmy is awesome with that. You should definitely go subscribe. I her. never thought that I would be able to do this. But I know I'll never win Best Stop Motion in the Sophie Awards because I can't make them long. But if I get iMovie, I won't be surprised if I win. I have a really awesome idea of an intro. So basically, since my channel is called AG Rainbow Studios, it's all about like rainbows and stuff. I would have one of my dolls, and I would have to get rainbow colored clothing. But anyway, I'd have them walk up in like normal clothes, and then they'd do a back handspring, and it would be like a stop motion. But then like the clothing would change color into a rainbow, and then it would have like a song in the same my channel name, and it would just be like so cool and awesome and. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I really hope you guys hope that I get to use iMovie, because I hope that I do, and I hope you guys hope that I do. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll talk to you guys in my next video, which I have two videos planned tomorrow, which I'll probably think of more ideas, but tomorrow is Labor Day, so we all get to stay home from school, which I'm super excited about. So, look out for a stop motion for AD Dream Studios contest. And a video on how to do DIY makeup on your dolls that you can remove. So, talk to you guys in the next video. Bye. I don't know why I always do that. I'm just, bye.